This is an off-grid gravity-powered light that I built for my closet. And it works by pulling down on this string, which goes over a couple of pulleys, and then turns this wheel that's connected to a synchronous motor. And the synchronous motor acts as an alternator that generates electricity, which gets sent to this LED panel. And um, at the same time that um, this pulling down on the string turns this wheel, it also lifts this bottle full of water, which acts as a counterweight. And once it gets lifted as far as it can go, and I let go of the string, it becomes a, it functions as a gravity battery. So it keeps the light on while it's falling. And you can see there's no light fixtures in any of the closets in this house. So I bought this uh, LED light. It came with a rechargeable lithium ion battery and a motion sensor. So it would come on when you um, open the closet door and we're trying to find something. And it just stayed on for like a minute or so or 30 seconds. Um, but it ran out of batteries and I just kept forgetting to charge it. So it just uh, stopped working. And um, obviously the easiest solution would be to just remember to charge it. But I got so annoyed that I just decided to build this. I just sort of wondered if I could fix the problem by doing this. I'm much happier with this situation. Um, and uh, it works for me. And the other reason it works is because uh, since the synchronous motor uh, sends out alternating current, um, then uh, you run it, I run it through this bridge rectifier and these capacitors. And that means that it doesn't matter which way um, you turn the, uh, turn the motor shaft, uh, it generates electricity uh, just as well. The synchronous motors, uh, maybe not all of them, but this one, it's designed to go clockwise and counterclockwise. And it also puts out, it says four watts. Uh, I'm probably not getting four watts, but that's about enough for a low wattage uh, LED. So it pretty much um, replaces those lithium ion batteries. And it's just in here whenever I need it. And as far as I'm concerned, it solves the problem. So, Yay.